is Ska Keller, I'm a member of the European Parliament, the Greens obviously, and I'm uh, from Germany, actually around this region. Okay. And how are you involved with the Green Summer University? Well, I'm doing quite a few things. Uh, this morning uh, we had, or this afternoon, rather this noon, we had a movie show of a movie that deals with climate migration uh, that uh, was um, that my office did, so it's a very nice movie. And tomorrow we're going to have a plenary uh, session on uh, the issue of populism, right-wing populism, and how to deal with that, what sort of um, populisms exist in Europe and how the Greens could find an answer to that. And then also I'm going to have a workshop on activism, like to explore what sort of activism can be used on the streets, um, what are the advantages and disadvantages of certain methods. Great, and what are your expectations or hopes to emerge out of these seminars? Do you hope that kind of Greens from around Europe will be able to share ideas and find solutions, common campaigns, this kind of thing, or something else? Absolutely, I mean, it would be great if people could um, take also the things that they have discussed in the seminars to their home country, to their green environments, and to further discuss them here, because of course this can only be a start and probably won't find a lot of solutions like right away, but um, to take on that, like you're not allowed alone, there's other experiences, and it's worth to share those experiences in order to get something out of them, absolutely. And what is the significance for you of having the Green Summer University here and now also in Frankfurt am Oder Subica? I think it's very good that we're here since it's like, like it's, it's not really Eastern Europe, it's sort of Central Europe, but still it's on the border. Um, it's a town which is just across the border, like two towns across the border, ri river, and that's I think fairly significant for having a European Summer University. Mm -hmm. And also this town uh, definitely needs some green support and it's an area where not a lot of greens are usually seen. We have a small uh, local group, but it's very important also to show that greens don't only go to the capital, not only to big cities, etc., but they also come to smaller towns and, and, and take this space to discuss. And also, I think usually it's better to have university seminary things uh, rather in small towns rather than in big cities where everybody just runs around in the evening. <laughs>